Evening guys, it's Rob here. How are you all? Hope everyone is well. So last Wednesday, I went into the market during the daytime to give you an idea of what it's going to be like. We were going to go back in on Wednesday night. However, we didn't. Um, we didn't do this because the weather turned horribly here in Edinburgh. It rained, torrential rain. It was gale force winds of 80 plus miles an hour. Um, I don't even know where the market was open last Wednesday. So we didn't go. However, um, I finished, finished work. It's Tuesday the 4th of December today. So I'm gonna go into town to meet Ash. Um, and we're gonna have a look around the market and to show you what it will look like at night time, which is completely different to the day. Hopefully I'll be there before her because she doesn't finish work till half five. So we'll see. Um, I want to get the tram in. I might get off at Shamrock Place and I'll take you with me. Just to show you the, um, the lights at that end of the west. The west end of Penta Street. We'll walk along Penta Street, up onto George Street. Show you the street of lights. And along there. And we'll see. And hopefully by the time I get along to Hanover Street. I should be walking up and we'll be able to meet up and see what happens. So I'll be back on a bit guys, so bye bye. Hi guys, I'm now in town. It's very busy. I suppose it's good for Edinburgh. Um, I got the tram in, I did tell you that before. Now, I had a new tram driver. The only reason I know this is um, they had someone else in the cab with them. They do it quite often, they recruit quite a lot. Um, on the charms in Edinburgh. I guess they're doing other cities as well. So yeah, it was alright. She was fine up until Haymarket, then it went a bit hairy because I'm, I'm guessing the tracks were quite slippy with the arse we've had today. You can hear the wheels slipping. But she was good, she was fine. So that's my show Pinter Street. Bye guys, I was going to go along Pinter Street but it looks very dull and not very Christmassy. The lights aren't on the trees this year. So I'm on a different way. I'm going to show you Angel Share which is at the West End. Look at it. It's not as good as a dome, but it's all very well lit. It used to really be a post office, I believe. It's now one of the most splendid bars here in Edinburgh, in the West End. So we'll go past Angel Share, past Charlotte Square, and onto, I think, George Street to show you the, the Street of Lights. And they've got a little market on there as well, so we'll show you that as well. Um, my phone keeps going off, so I'm guessing that's Ashley or probably work. We'll find out. So, it wasn't work, it was just a game. So, that can wait. So, I'm just on South Charlotte Street, I think. West Charlotte Square. There's a tree. I'm walking past all the nice restaurants. It's all very Christmassy. The lights are all up, which is quite cool. I want to see cross over, but I'm getting my nail up. Trying to vlog at the same time as crossing over roads. It's never good. And we'll show you the tree. And I'll take a few pictures for you as well. And I'll put the pictures in for you right now. So for those eagle-eyed people, will notice there's a cherry picker in that picture. He's just put the tree up. <laughs> it's a bit late really, because in the market opened on two weeks ago. But I think it's a real tree, so that's probably why it's just going up today. But um, it's trying to do it in the dark, which is probably the best time to put lights on a tree. Uh, yeah, but it looks like it's very top heavy with lights. So, yeah. I'm just going to cross over. Is it now? This is South Charlotte Street. I know what that was called before. So I'm going to cross over the lights. And I'm going to show you George Street and the Street of Lights. Okay, guys, I'm now on George Street. All good and the Street of Lights. Now, last year, this my played music. And it danced and all sorts. I'll show you a close look in a minute. However, this year, it is slightly different. This year, they're doing a side disco. As you can see by the sign. This is where you put your headphones off on. So, 
Two shows, three playlists, pick your playlist and pick your show. £4.50 for tickets, which be available ticket or goes to the One City Trust, which is a... I think it's for the homeless, I don't know, I think. So this will run from 16th of November through to the 5th of January. Let me show you guys a lot, look at it. It's quite cool. It's not, it's nice to see without any music. Um, we did it when it was on the Royal Mile and it was very, very busy. If you don't like being in confined spaces with a lot of people, it's probably not the thing for you. Is it worth paying the £4.50? I don't know, I've never done it with the Cyan Disco. Um, but I would do fancy having a, a go at it. But we'll see. But you can walk down it even without, you know, because with the Cyan Disco you have headphones. So it makes it a bit different. So you can still walk down it when it's dancing. You just want to hear the music, so yeah. So I'm now on George Street, so you have Browns and you have Eden Loch. I don't know what this place is. I think this one's new. This is just here. Next to that is Tiger Lily. We've been here a few times. Very nice cocktails. Very expensive, but very, very nice. This sort of thing can be you too. You stop being a big kid. You're a big kid all your life. <laughs> yeah. Or maybe there's a bit right in between where you don't bother about stuff and you get the difference. <laughs> <laughs> so that display was just on the toy lily. I don't know how they did it. Because it's not from over here. Anywhere. Over here, over here, behind me. No, this way, in front of me. But it's on a building. <laughs> so, I don't know. It's very clever, though. I like it. Okay, so Ash finished work at 5 30. So I've still got some time. I might go and walk me from work. She won't know that. But she will when she watches this. But I don't know whether I will or not. I'm unsure. Depends what else I can vlog on my way down. So you can see, I'm still, I'm still in the street of lights. There used to be fairground here last year, like mazes and all sorts. Well, that's not here this year. So I don't know. Oh, that's one of the gardens, I think. Um, so we'll see. Now, what they do during Edinburgh Christmas, they close off a lot of roads around the fair for safety reasons um, so I'm putting on George Street this you can drive so far along George Street and you can't drive any further so this is one of the barriers there's two there's one here there's one a bit further on one over here as well there but this is the kid the market for the children I think kids so one tree some rides so some of the kiddie rides let's go and see how much these cost I have no idea Little car ride just goes round and round in circles. Taylors of Edinburgh. I don't know how much it costs. There's no sign, guys, so I can't really tell you. And then there's the balloon ride. So you buy your tickets from the box office located on George Street, which is the one where I showed you where you get your tickets from for the sign disco. I don't want to do that because you guys are all there. You've got Mimi's Cupcakes. This is a cupcake shop in Edinburgh on Frederick Street. They've also got a store this year. That's quite cool. Santa's Candy Shop. Oh, Candy Floss. I love Candy Floss. And then you have Santa's Grotto. Here. Um, again, you buy your tickets from the ticket office on George Street. I don't want the fun. What's he? Huge shows. So, in this show, you choose what happens. Every show is different. I don't watch show that time, but being honest, no idea. 
So let's go along Rose Street. Let's go this way. So I'm heading east. These lights up of Rose Street, they're on all year round. Rose Street is the most is the street that's famous for pubs. One of the streets famous for pubs. Um, on the South African Edinburgh game that I went to on the vlog, which I vlogged during the game, me and Eric, my father-in-law, worked our way along this street and went to about eight or nine different pubs. Hence why I can't remember putting the video on YouTube, but it was very good, very good indeed. So finally, get me Ash from work and he's got a move on. It's finished at half past five. It's quarter past five now. I've still got to walk along to the part of George Street, down Hanover Street, down Dundas Street, onto St. King Street, although it's called, I have no idea. And I think it'll take me longer than 15 minutes, but we'll have a go. Alright, guys, so I'm walking along George Street again. This is where you find all the expensive shops here in Edinburgh. So, Carl and Scott, Lululemon Lulu, Lulu Athletic, Jigsaw, um, Who's in Curtis, the assembly rooms. This is not a shop. This is where I do all the shows. And a few years ago, to the building here, they did the X Factor. Yeah, I used to work here in this building. Very redundant. Oh well, these things happen. Um, Lord Ashley here, Jigsaw. Yeah. yeah. He's known as Stuffy Words, and now he needs to come and do some stuff where he used to work. Timberland, that's new. Across the street. Um, yeah. Well, all the trees are all lit up. I can't see because the bus is here. We're all in the middle of the centre reservation, there's trees. Which is more light than it was on Princess Street, I think. I haven't got there yet, so we'll have a look when we get there with Ash. Yeah. So I'm trying to get a bit of a move on, because I've got probably 13 minutes to meet her. So I'm kind of rushing a little bit. We'll see what's going on. Hi right, guys, I made it across Queen Street. I'm now walking down Dundas Street. I did a sale the other day. Well, I did the first in the morning vlog of the market when I came to bring Ash some for work, I don't want to bring her. Some for lunch, I think. I don't know. So I'm hoping I'm not going to miss her. I've still got another set of lights to go across. Um, and then hopefully I'll get there for when she finishes. That's the plan anyway. The spies are outside of work. We'll see. And I'll be like, I'm vlogging! Ha -ha. One thing about this street, I've been down this street twice. Once now, once earlier. Last week. On the first part of this vlog. <laughs> There is a lot, and I mean a lot, of galleries, art shops. <laughs> um, very expensive, very, very expensive uh, house, place, I think. What's it called? Uh, hey, uh, I can't know what it's called. Where you buy your houses? There. <laughs> A little bit thick. <laughs> What's it called? Um, yeah, I can't remember. Them, them things. Where you go and you see what house you want. <laughs> oh dear, I can't remember what it's called at all. Oh, silly me. Estate agent. That's what it's called. Really couldn't remember. Complete blank. House thing. Yeah, one of them. Estate agents. <laughs> yeah. So there is a lot of art galleries, a lot of places to buy art, um, that kind of thing. Yeah, so it's and there's loads of abandoned shops on this one, which is sad. I don't know what it is, it's very creepy. So this is Great King Street now. This is where Ash works. So let's go and surprise her. Off we go. The thing is though, because I'm going to meet her and I've not told her, I'm really hoping that I've not missed her. If I have, I've got to walk back up the hill on my own. If I haven't, it'll be a nice surprise for her. So, I'm really hoping, 100%, I haven't missed her. Then I'll show you office if I can. But no, I can't go in, obviously. But I'll show you the outside. 
Right, the good news is I've made it. This one here with all the thing foliage is Ash's work. The bad news is because I don't know where our office is, a desk. I don't know if she's here or not. Ooh, let's find out when she comes out the door. Hopefully not very long because it's quite chilly. Very, very chilly today. It was minus five this morning when I had to work at half past five. And so yeah, hopefully she's still here. Touch wood. I got her, look. I met her from work. She didn't leave. Always a bonus. However, she just told me she said two glasses of Prosecco. She's going to be feeling rough tomorrow. Because we're going for potatoes. Potatoes from the market. She's going to be talking garbage now because she's had drinks. Yes. Good evening, guys. Hi. So we went to the German market. Yeah. Um, Edinburgh, as I said, I didn't vlog this time. No, we were too hungry. We were too hungry, it was actually really, really busy. Yeah, it so wasn't too busy. But I didn't want to hold the camera. It was going. busy for a Thursday. Yeah. No, what day is it? Tuesday. Tuesday. Two Prosecco's, no idea what's Two like Prosecco's, a little bit of moonshine, and a Bailey's. Oh, good. So we had potatoes. Start from the top of my head. Potatoes with sausage, cheese. Uh, yeah, it's really nice. Very nice. It's five pounds for the medium. I think seven fifty for the large. Just seven. Seven. We had just had the, the medium one, not small. It's very nice though. Yeah. Uh, we took some pictures. So what I'll do, I'll put those pictures in for you right now. And then we went to around the market a little bit. Yeah. And then we went to the Baileys. Hot, hot chocolate Baileys mm -hmm. stand. Mm -hmm. Oh, they did a coffee in. They did a coffee Baileys well. I did actually well. mean to ask for a coffee, but I asked for two hot chocolates instead. Do you know, I'm enjoying this start and it took my head. Um, and we took photos of those as well. Yeah. So I'll put those in as well for you right yeah. now. And then we got the bus home. Yeah. So that's us. And now she's got a star in her head. Ding, 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 ding. I'm a star. No, you're not. Um, so yeah, that's us. We're going to. Also, we failed at Vlogmas. We were yeah, going we to do, do it. We were going to do Vlogmas, but I think we're new vloggers, so what we're doing just now is quite a lot. Yeah. So, so we maybe do, next year. Maybe next year we'll do it probably because yeah. we'll be away. Also, a big thank you to all the subscribers we've yeah. had over the last couple of weeks. We've gone from like 30... 35 to 75. 75 in like in this three weeks. space of like three weeks. So, so thanks, that's good. Thank thanks. you for subscribing. Yeah, and share. Share us and hopefully we'll get more subscribers. And Often. yeah, thanks again. Thanks like again. and subscribe if you do like us. <laughs> Speak to you soon. Speak to you soon, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.